So when you open the kit for this COVID test, everything you see here is going to come in this small baggie right here. And this is the instructions for use. Read it if you like, but have everything you need about it. So going further on, once you take it out of the baggie, you're going to have your COVID test strip, the actual device with that patented action we spoke of that when you place everything, you bring the lower receiver up. That must be done. You're going to have a small pipette. This one works very well. And when you're drawing the blood up, just draw it up right in the, just the distal aspect of it. And then as soon as it's drawn up in this small part, just put it right into the cassette. This is a spring-loaded safety lancet. You just screw this off, and then you just put the end of this right against the skin and push forward, and it springs and will draw your sample. This is your buffer fluid. So you're going to be using the same pipette that you would draw the blood up to use the buffer. And, of course, you're going to go ahead and use your alcohol swab. Remember, it's alcohol swab. You swab the finger, you prick the finger, you draw up some blood, you swab again, and then once the blood expresses, you use a pipette, put the blood on the sample, use the same pipette at that point to draw up some buffer, two drops into each, in, uh, into this sample well, slide it forward, and let the result be evident after the 10 minute run. Okay, I want to introduce you to the COVID-19 rapid test strip. This is from Alpha Scientific. And this are going to be the test strips that you will be receiving for our COVID-19 testing. I want to give you an introduction on what this cassette is, what it does, and some of these special features that must be done when you are administering each test. So first you see an opening right here so this is going to be where your one drop of blood will be placed and then after that you're going to go ahead and place two drops of buffer good, good rule of thumb is to do one drop of buffer count to one one thousand and do a second drop of buffer so it doesn't overcome itself as soon as the buffer has been placed what you're going to do is simply take the lower receiver and you're going to push it forward locking it into place. Now what this does is it takes the sample, which is the blood, and the buffer and it forces it into the membranes. So at this point, as it starts to permeate up through this uh, absorbable paper, it will make the, uh, the connection with the membranes and mix the components up and as it comes up and hits M, G, and C, it will take that good solid sample and have an appropriate response to it so the accuracy is uh, not only good it's fantastic so the control which is C the control must be present with every test if the C is not present then you have to redo the test that means something didn't work right okay G is for IgG that is the uh, antibody assessment tool for the um, antibodies being present for SARS COVID-19 and IgM, which is the M, that will be present if there is a viral response that has been uh, in place. We call it the acute phase. So these are things to know, the M and the G and the C, and then the results are typically done in three to seven minutes, 10 minutes to be safe. But just don't forget to slide this lower receiver up as it is a patented device that will ensure that the contact with the sample and the membranes are wholeheartedly interacted to make the accuracy of this test do exactly as it was designed to do, give you solid results quickly and fast. Hey team, it's Sean Hensler. So I wanted to be sure I went through everything really well with you, what you're going to be getting, what the kit looks like, the packaging um, box will come like this. You see that? And uh, 
So remember our capability statement is on there. We can get that for you. And we already have EUA approval. We should have EUA FDA approval by the end of the week. Um, we have uh, undergone a sample size of over 900 uh, patients, 300 per lab. That's nine times what they require just to meet the standard. So with our patented device that we have, again, sliding the lower assembly forward uh, or superior to be able to um, force the membranes and the buffer and the, and the sample together to give uh, very good results as advertised results, it will be a uh, formidable test for us uh, during this pandemic. Every, every safety lancet will be spring-loaded and we want to make sure that you're using this small pipette, okay? The small one, this is the one that works the best. And beyond that, everything should go smooth. Again, uh, reach out anytime if you have any questions or concerns. Thank you.